Today, my husband and I visited the Naval Arsenal Memorial in Toyokawa with Mr. Oba. Just between the bombings of Nagasaki and Hiroshima in World War II was the bombing of the Naval Arsenal in Toyokawa on August 7, 1945. More than 2,500 lives were lost and many of them mere teenagers. Among the lives that were lost was Mr. Oba's teen sister. This is Deborah Renakamura and you're watching Heart of Japan. So many B-29 attacks here. Is this the actual site of the factory? No, no, no. No, this is just the no, memorial. It, it's far from one kilometer uh, west, away. West from here. Because it had a uh, memorial, big park uh, for uh, these people. My elder sister died. She was a uh, high school student of Toyohashi Commercial High School at that time. Uh, she was 15 years old. That's because during the war, they used high school students to work in the factories. You had two sisters working oh, yes. in the factory, but only one died. Why? One well, sister did not work at daytime. They have a house for student, another place. They work at night. My younger sister uh, worked uh, daytime, started about uh, 10 o'clock, maybe. It's all around. Oh, yes. This is Hashi Ladies Commercial High School. Oba Sachiko. Sachiko. Yes, this is her friend. All of these people here are from the high school. That is that right? Higashi High School. Fair Hashi Sakura Gaoka. Pihon Dai. Uh-huh. Meiji University. Uh-huh. Aoyama. Aoy Ritsumeikan. Uh Setsunan. This is Fair Hashi Industry High School. This is Fair Hashi High School. This makes me sad. Do you know why? A whole generation of young people lost. They could have been future doctors and leaders of the world in Japan. What did they do at this place? For Navy. She was working at this factory every day. Every day. From Kahara. She commuted by bicycle? No, 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 train. From here, maybe it takes more an hour from my house. So what was she doing about school? Was she not going to school during that time? Uh, she belonged to county area. Because uh, they were commercial high school. Every high school has to send here. So n not much studying was going no, on? No, no, no. Of course, no. it's war. What can you say? War breaks down lots of things of society. At that time, labor was so short. Did you expect an air raid? We didn't know about it. Mm -hmm. Because we, uh, we have lived in Nahara, close to Pacific coast. Uh but my father knew about it. Uh, How? How did he know? Uh, maybe pay for. So uh, he came there by bicycle from uh, Tahara, but uh, it uh, it to, to enter uh, after one week. Uh, one week after? Uh, well, he must well, have been so well, well. sad. Uh, I remember the day, uh, maybe uh, 10 o'clock, just like uh, each day, we knew uh, so many B-29 bombers uh, fly in the sky, uh. but it's rare. It's too close. Nobody noticed they attacked Toyokawa factory. People who live in Toyohashi need to look here. Yes, Toyokawa and Toyohashi are neighboring cities. But uh, Tahara, they didn't know about it. We knew it uh, in the evening. I still remember. She did not show her feelings. I, that makes me sad. I'm sorry. And it's not my desire to bring up sad feelings, but I feel like Mr. Oba's message is important to show you that people are hurt by wars and we don't need them. It's something we can get rid of. We don't need wars. But we can't get any body. Never? Never. Oh. We only get her hair and her back. But uh, it's Right. Oh, right. how have you thought about this this horrible happening during your life? How has it affected you? Anyway, that time, 
so many people died. Mm. During war, uh, people with different uh, normal age, we have been struggled uh, because of the death. But fortunately, she had five children. Mm -hmm. after. I think you told me that your older sister is very hurt by her younger sister dying. I would ask her about it. Uh -huh. Their house is very close from family. Uh huh. But she, she, she never talk. She never will it. talk about this. Uh, Even if you tried to ask her. Uh, yes, many times. No. But, uh, uh, How old was she when her sister died? One year after. So sixteen years. So she after air raid. Uh huh. Uh, they have. They had to work one week because the dead body. No, they carry, made them carry. work to carry the dead bodies. Even though it was their friends and their family, I guess there's no choice. So, uh, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry to put you through this. My husband warned me that bringing up such pain is not a good thing for people. But to this extent, I believe that we need to be aware of what war does, and we need not to choose it as a, a solution. Sorry. Uh, it, no, it, I'm it, sorry. It, it passed uh, 75 years still, uh, I remember clearly. Uh, after uh, one week, she came to back my house. My uh, husband and her uh, very, very sad. Very sad. It's understandable. It's unbelievable that anyone could go through such things and even 75 years later that you and I are talking because when I think of it, I'm in Japan now and I'm in Japan peacefully actually and we are friends. I'm a teacher and, and he's a student but we are still friends and that's a miracle. Yeah, because uh, the source of your pain happens to be war, but it was also my countrymen that uh, bombed, that did the air raid. But um, I pray that all of our pain will be healed.